All right, dears, in this video, I am jumping right back in headfirst to Dimash. A bunch of you have sent me this video. The song is called Stranger. And here's what the description says on the video. Dimash presented a song with a Kazakh folk instrument at the grand opening of the International Competition of Young Performers, New Wave 2021 in Sochi, Russia. I'm, you know what? Actually, I'm going to tell you something. I had a few people in other videos, and there was one comment in particular, and it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad of a comment, but somebody had said that they just sort of prefer a different type of singing style and stuff than Dimash. And then uh, shortly after that, I got a DM, but from a different person on Instagram. And they said, what do you like about Dimash? Like, I, I don't, I don't get it is basically what they're saying. I don't understand the appeal. And I wrote back and I told them that the appeal for me is number one, he has a uniquely amazing voice. I think it's one of the best voices in the whole world. That that's truly how I feel about his voice. I think it's, it's not only is it unique, it's just, it's, the things that he does are incredible. Uh, his range, I feel like, is untouchable. I mean, it's just, it's, I just feel like it's unsurpassed when you look at vocalists right now in the world and it's uh, all time type of thing. The other thing is, I love that his tone of his voice, even when he goes in lower registers, higher registers, head voice, um, it's always there. It's always amazing. Because some singers, when they go into something, they kind of lose that thing, that tone that I love. He doesn't. Everywhere he goes, there's a certain sound that just, it just blows me away. One of the other things that really drawn me into Dimash is his stage presence. I feel like he has a command that is, I really feel like it's unrivaled. Of all the people I cover on this channel, and I've been saying this, if you go back and watch my Dimash videos, he has such command of the audience. It's like nothing I've ever seen. The fingers, he could, he can make everybody quiet and he can make them rise. It, it, it's to me, it's an incredible sight. I love to see it. And it's, um, it's an honor and a privilege. The final thing I say that uh, really kind of drew me into Dimash was I feel like he loves his fans. And there's a handful of artists that I cover that I feel really, truly, truly love their fans. Like you guys know, I cover more set on this channel and I just did that interview with her and we talked about her fans. It's the same thing with Dimash. I feel like there's a special certain special kind of artists that just they embrace their fans they love their fans so much and i would put dimash in that co category i feel like he just there's a real connection with him and his fans and it makes me very happy being a fan being a deer and if you haven't subscribed to me yet make sure you subscribe to this channel hit the notification bell so you know when i drop a new dimash episode because we are jumping back in and somebody told me stranger is one of a few new songs so from my understanding is there's a couple new songs out here that we're gonna do together. All right, let's get to this. Oh, I like his hair. Looks a little different. What an intro. Music, Igor Kudai, lyric Shane. Okay. Wow, this has an epic feel to it. Oh man, he looks epic. Oh. Wow. 
And see that, how low he goes there? Amazing. Hear that note? Oh. Oh. that tone right there okay, that's my favorite tone though from him your feet everyone oh my goodness gracious Dimash Kudabergen Igor Krutoy Bravo Спасибо огромное Спасибо большое Wow Wow Сильно Присильно Bravo Ну конечно Невероятные эмоции мы испытываем от голоса Димаша. Димаш Кудаберген, браво! Спасибо огромное, спасибо, спасибо. Игорь Крутой! И лучший хобзист мира, мой друг, гость из Казахстана, Уолжас Хурмабек! Спасибо! О, мэн! Это было... О, Oof, oof, oof. Man, I'm, I, I miss Dimash. I miss that voice. I stayed away too long, man. That, oh, oh, man, 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 man. Okay, I want to say this. If that's not your style of music, I get it, okay? I understand that because we all like a certain style of music. There is no denying what we just witnessed right there, right? I mean, as a just a music fan or a vocal fan or being in awe of somebody that has superior talent like Dimash does... You, I understand if it's not for you, the style of music, because I understand that. It's not, it's, that's not my f preferred style of music either. You know, I, I love rock and I love pop music and stuff. I can listen to that all day. That That is that is amazing, what we just heard right there. That is an even, like I said, even if it's not your style, that is truly amazing. 
that last note, I, I mean, I almost want to go back and time it and see how long that note is. I mean, that is, he just held it and the key just changed and he just stayed right there and he was putting a vibrato in there. I don't know how the heck he does these super high notes and then right away, boom, he's into the super low <laughs> register. It's, it truly is incredible. And to sing it, and the thing is, it's not like he's just going up and down on these scales and, and, and singing. He's singing completely in pitch, in key. Everything is perfect. Everything is perfect. That's the challenge right there. People can do runs and do these things, but to be perfect, that was perfection right there. That was, that was, oh, that was amazing. This guy, man. Dimash Kudibergen. Wow. That is a generational talent right there. I want to talk about his his uh, stage, his outfit tonight. Of all, because I always try to mention on his outfits because I love like the the stuff that his stage presence, you know, is is well. This is a great testament to what his stage presence is like. He's amazing on stage, but his outfit, I'm gonna say that that is that's my favorite outfit of all the videos I've done. I don't know how many Dimash episodes I have. Um, is it a dozen? I, I don't know, but that's my favorite Dimash wardrobe right there. He had this. It was just this epic feel and, I, and the, with the white shirt and the black tie. It was just, oh man, it was so good. It was almost like, uh, I don't know, man. It was like this, this superhero, like Bruce Lee kind of vibe. It was just so confident and it was so, um, I don't know, man. It was just so swaggy. It, that was the whole thing. Everything about that instrumentation, singing, outfit, visuals. It was amazing. That's it. All right, it's Tommy Mars. I'll be back here very soon with another Dimash episode. So I understand there's a couple more songs from there, and I think one of them, if I'm not mistaken, somebody told me there's Ave Maria, which is on there. Uh, really, I almost started with that today, but more people asked for Stranger. When I was taking vocal lessons, this was years ago, because I really wanted to learn how to sing and, and you know push and everything and diaphragm and everything. Uh, this is one of the songs that we had to learn, and... Uh, I know it's not going to sound anything like he's going to do, but I'm so interested to see that. So I'm thinking that'll probably be the next one. But if there's something else I'm missing, or if there's, well, actually, you know what? That's a good question. Is there one more song or is there two more songs from this? You guys will let me know. All right. I'll see you guys soon. It's Tommy Mars. Take care. Peace.